Hello, my friend. This is Victor Piccini, and welcome to the Be Seen and Heard journey. Videos and audios that will empower you. Hey, it's Victor. Welcome to another Be Seen and Heard journey. Thank you so much for being here with me today. This is a special episode of the BSH journey because today is Martin Luther King Jr. Day, and this is a very important day. We all know what he stood for. We all know what he did to change the world. And yesterday I was listening to a bunch of his speeches, excerpts from his speeches, and I'm just so inspired because he was someone who shared his voice. And I recall many, many years ago when I started presenting in schools, he actually inspired me to create a program called My Dreams, where I actually talk to kids about what were some of their dreams that they want to accomplish when they're older and what are some of their goals. And I always used to put up Martin Luther King Jr. quotes because he really, really inspired me. And what he taught me was we can all dream, but know that it's not always going to be easy to obtain the dream. There is going to be adversity along the way, and we all know that he had a lot of that in his life. But today, I want to talk about really the impact of what I believe was one of the most important tools he had, and that was his voice. His voice changed the world. When you heard him speak, everyone listened. What would have happened if he never had the courage to use his voice? And that's what today's episode is all about. I really think the lessons in Martin Luther King Jr.'s speeches is the very fact that if you want something to happen in your life, you have to first start by sharing that dream or sharing what is on your mind. And I think as adults, we have to advocate for our children because I know growing up, I never really had a voice. I was never asked, what do you think, Victor? No one ever asked me that because I was just a kid. I think it's time that we really understand that children deserve that voice. And I think we need to advocate for them and help them create the courage to share. To share when something isn't right in their life and not to keep it locked up inside. Or to share one of their dreams or one of their goals or something that's bothering them. Not be afraid to put it out there. Because what would have happened if Martin Luther King Jr. was afraid to put it out there? I'm telling you, it's very powerful. So today, as I think about Martin Luther King Jr., I'm inspired. I want to go out and share my voice with the world, and I get the opportunity to do that every day. So with that being said, please share your voice, and don't be afraid to do that. And remember, everyone young children, older children, we all have the right to be seen and heard. Use that voice. Please share this with your friends and family. Thank you so much and have an amazing day. Hey, my friend, I hope you enjoyed this episode of the Be Seen and Heard journey. If you'd like to follow me, please go to youtube.com forward slash Victor Piccini or instagram.com forward slash childhood victories or head over to facebook.com forward slash childhood victories or visit my website, victorpiccini.com. Please share this with your friends and family. And until next time, be seen and heard.